rear end is profoundly sore. Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. You know, I think I've heard of the Far Lands before. I'd be surprised if you hadn't. The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Guys, we can't turn back now. Not after coming so far. Fine, but I'm taking a break. So am I. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> Everyone doing okay? Not really. We're starving. Potato? You're coming with me. It's not much, but it'll help. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. Check out what I found. A potato. Incredible. Hey, at least it's food. Potato number two, coming your way. Can I have this one? Oh, you had the last one. Oh, yeah. You take it, Ivor. I'm Sorin, not Ivor. Right, of course you are. Hey. You guys want to help me look? Probably best if we stay with the horses. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. A witch's hut. Ah! We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look. 
That's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Let's get out of here. Good idea. <laughs> Guys! Jesse, did you find any more food? Actually, yeah. I have more potatoes, but it'll have to wait. There's a witch nearby. We saw her creeping through the swamp and... She's here! <laughs> oh no, you don't. Watch out for her potions! And skeletons? That's a deadly combination. Her potions combined with their arrows? Oh, we'll all be killed. The Farlands are just past the swamp. But they've seen us. They'll just follow us. The rest of you, go! I'll hold them off. What? Ivor, no! There's no time to argue. Just head for the corner of the glitch wall. The what wall? Hey, you witch! You're not the only one who can throw a potion. Potatoes! Guys, I think we lost him for... Wow. You lost him for wow? What is that? Oh. Wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. But at least Jesse found those potatoes. That might be the saddest sentence ever uttered. <laughs> By the sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory, like a monument to chaos itself. Soren, have you been here before? Not here specifically, but I have visited the Far Lands. The Order traveled far and wide during our heyday. Incredible. You can say that again. Incredible. It doesn't seem as scary as I imagined it. Huh? A little fear is healthy sometimes, Jesse. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if the rest of our group was with us. Come on. Would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Fortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that Ivor built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. I 
Everyone needs to take better care of this place. Huh. We can probably climb these. Everyone! On guard! There's too many! We can't fight them all! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the paths connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there. Must be Ivor's lab. Wish it was a little closer. I first met Reuben near a waterfall like this. Hope the little guy's okay.
to be kidding me. Or kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball.
Neat. A redstone block. That'll come in handy. Okay. I don't see a way across. Redstone blocks, some pistons. Wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Have you found a way out of here? A way out? I only just found you. This maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the Dream Team reunited. <laughs> now the Dream Team's just gotta find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side, but it's in really bad shape, and it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. It can't be that complicated. Not if it's something Ivor built. Half built, which means it was hard enough that he got stuck and gave up. layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. Who cares what she said? I do. She's the greatest redstone engineer ever. She's in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people. Just like us. Right. Just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name. None of them give Eligard any respect. And Magnus lost his life trying to fight this. The Order can't do this. How are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? All I know is, the world is depending on us. Then maybe the world is in trouble. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Well, we won that building contest at Endercon. That was a contest, Jesse. Right. And the competition was stiff. Just think what we can do when there's nobody even watching. I like that way of looking at it. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Sooner the better.
Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. Holy cow, we did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. It must be this way! Run! Everybody get on! Quick, onto the barge! That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment, I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> Soren, are you afraid of flying? <laughs> what? The, the man's mad. He's wither crazy. Ah. <laughs> well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia. Well, that was exciting. Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. So many books. We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. A brief history of cubism. Crafting for noobs. <laughs> Revised. A collector's guide to precious gems. None of these are enchanting books. How to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew. Potionology, volume 24. Oh, none of these seem to be enchanting books either. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. That first night we all spent together... Lucas left because he had to. He said he owed it to his friends. I get that. I'd do the same thing for you guys. For the right price, of course. Of course. What's the point of friendship if it doesn't pay? See? This is why we get along so well. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't tried to fight those cursed witches, he could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. We don't need Ivor. We can find this book on our own. Ha! <laughs> in this mess? Are you mad? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. How I learned to stop worrying and love mining. Hmm. The unabridged redstone encyclopedia. 
Zombies and pigs, an intimate memoir. I think I'm in the wrong part of the house. Ruben, what are you doing? Yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before. Stay away from lava. Hey, Olivia. I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. <sighs> Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. This Ivor character, I'm recalling that he knew something about potions. Could one of these stop the wither monsters? I'm remembering correctly, am I not? We actually already tried that. I assume it was unsuccessful. Ivor's potions just aren't strong enough to undo this mess he created. Oh, I see. Potion of blindness, potion of dullness, potion of nausea. None of these will help me. Jesse, am I going to be all right? Or is this just who I am now? Always struggling to remember what I was. Of course you'll be okay. You're Gabriel the Warrior. Thank you, Jesse. Your confidence in me is stronger than any potion. Except perhaps a potion of confidence. I wonder if he has one of those. Wood planks. Those will be useful. First, I'll need some sticks. There we go, a good old-fashioned lever. Which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. A secret passageway? Hmm. Why would you build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits? More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there. We'll head down and see what we can find. Incredible! 
He's gathered them all in one place. Gathered... what exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Oh, the stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there. Locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. These gas tears, they're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours. And these tears were our reward. Wow. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Mm, very well. Just be careful with it. See? Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon Egg? Huh, alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. Am I crazy? Or is this a sea lantern? Ah! The very same one the Order built, all those years ago. Oh, we were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? So where'd this packed ice come from? We brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery. Locked. These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Elagard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. Aha! A hopper! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Looks like a regular hopper. That's hooked up to a bunch of Fredstone circuitry. Man, Ivor sure does love his puzzles. Hmm. Five slots. Prismarine crystals into the hopper. A sea lantern. In you go. Packed ice. Let's put it here. Gas 
tears. Let's try them here. Huh. Those were the right objects. But I guess it was the wrong order. Ender Dragon Egg. So cool. Let's try it here. Doesn't look right. This egg was the last thing they got as a group. Soren said this lantern was crafted from prismarine crystals. Huh. The Order used these crystals to make the sea lantern. Soren said they got this ice just before fighting the Ender Dragon. Nope. Soren said the Order got these gas tears on their very first mission together. Twenty possible combinations. If I know anything, it's how much Ivor loves puzzles. 
Indeed he does. Nice work, Jesse. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. By the stars, the Ender Dragon! With replica Ender Crystals and all! Wow. I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm. No way out. Hmm. Interesting. Four, but it isn't doing anything. Looks like a banner about TNT. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> We're missing something here, Soren. And I have a feeling the key might be locked in that head of yours. I have a key locked in my head? What I'm saying is, I think you need to tell me about the Ender Dragon battle. Oh! Ah, if only you'd been there. It was a fight. For the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so, the Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Only then. Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. That was absolutely amazing! They didn't call us the Order of the Stone for nothing. Hmm, wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? There's another door? Soren, tell me the story again. Certainly. 
We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well, all right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? Better. Thanks. Ruben, do you know what to do here? Oh well, it was worth a shot. Bow and arrow, great weapons. Bow and arrow. Great weapons. Looks like a banner about TNT. Hmm. That's redstone. That's a sword. Banner of a sword, anyway. Soren, tell me the story again. Certainly. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well, all right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? Better. Thanks. That's a sword. Well, a banner of a sword anyway.
Hey, Reuben, give me a boost, will ya? <laughs> kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore he was going to dispose of them. Soren, you said destroying these crystals was the key to defeating the Ender Dragon. You did kill the Ender Dragon, right? Jesse, this isn't this isn't what it looks like. Our story, uh, the story, it's it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. So what really happened, Soren? If you didn't destroy the Ender Crystals... I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I think it's time to start talking. Oh, I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact... We didn't even fight it. So what did you do to it? We didn't do anything. We used that damned command block. You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. Understand, when I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster, we could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. Concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. <laughs> Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon, and the rest is history. Soren. I looked up to you. The whole world did. Nobody is more ashamed than me. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? Ivor. How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts. Doesn't it? Is this why you left the Order? Because Soren lied. Because they all did. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. How conniving of us. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on her own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. And how is that any better? You reveal their lies at the expense of the world itself. Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. 
You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. For a moment, I nearly forgot. Well, they are. And while we sit around talking about your dysfunctional order of liars, those things are still out there, wrecking the world. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. This thing better work. Because if it doesn't... You don't need to say it. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor? I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well... It doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. Let's see. There's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamonds! Score! So I can craft whatever I want, huh? Anything at all. An axe? Just wait till you enchant it. Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Behold, my enchanted diamond axe. Yes, that should do the job nicely. If you're fighting those wither monsters head on, you'll want better armor, too. I enchanted these for the Order. They're about as strong as it comes. Even able to withstand TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. Men, believe me, they're all excellent. All right. Let me take a look at them. It's all quite durable and sturdy. They won't stop damage, but they'll help. This one is named Golden Goliath. As bright and powerful as the sun itself. I call this one the Ender Defender. Very strong against an Enderman's attack. I call this one the Shield of Infinity. In no small part, because it's infinitely cool. Ah, Dragon's Bane. Even the Ender Dragon would have fled from this in terror. I call this the Star Shield. No object in the universe can penetrate it. Adamantine Impervium! Even harder to damage than it is to pronounce! Take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. Wow, 
cool armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now, let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Witherstorms are doing against those Endermen. My poor fortress! I see Endermen, so this means the plan's working, right? Shouldn't the Endermen have dismantled those things by now? Or am I just confused? It's not just you. Something's wrong. Jesse, over here! Axel! You guys made it! Nice freaking armor, by the way. Makes you all a lot easier to look at. Good to see you too, Axel. So is it working? Can Jesse go in there and destroy the command block? Might not be as easy as you think. The Endermen, they're not angry enough. I mean, some of them are, but a lot of them are just standing around moving blocks. You know, being Endermen. Ah, blast! They've kept the main weather storm busy, but one of the smaller ones started attacking us. And Eligard ran off to fight that thing, all by herself. She's fighting a weather storm? Alone? Yep, kept saying something about paying for the mistakes of the past, whatever that means. If a fellow member of the Order of the... of the, uh... Order of the Stone. ...is out there fighting, then I belong out there too. Gabriel, no, no, I told you you're not who you think you are. My name is Gabriel the Warrior. And he's running the wrong way. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm not letting that idiot get himself killed! Gabriel! Come back here! <sighs> Without the command block, none of them stands a chance. Say what now? Why do they need the command block? Trust me, you don't want to know. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. Um, okay. Hey, uh, you guys didn't check on Petra, did you? No, we came straight here. All alone in that cave? I hope she's all right. She will be, as long as we destroy the command block. So what's the plan? I mean, I know we gotta go in there, but... Should we just go for it, or what? We confront the Witherstorm, and fight it to the death. Yeah! You do mean, it's death, right? Axel, just put on your helmet. What helmet? Here. Nice. I was feeling a little left out. Guys, let's go kick some command block butt. Enderman focus. I can't even make myself focus. We, we shouldn't be here. None of this is going according to plan. Soren, what are you doing? I, uh, you know, I've, I've really enjoyed meeting you all, but... Soren! Did Soren just run away? Soren, come back here! Dude, what a chicken. So much for the mighty Order of the Stone. It doesn't matter. We have work to do. We need to get those Endermen to attack it! The tractor beam! Jesse, that's it! Make them chase you into the tractor beam! Yes! They're falling 
for it. I found him near the cave. Here. All right. Let's see how you like this. to find you a way up. Or build you a way up. That's it. Everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see. I've got redstone and cobblestone from Ivor's armory. I have some TNT from Boomtown. I've got pistons, repeaters, some wool, some leftover slime. Oh, and I still have that minecart. That's got to be enough to make something, right? I mean, if we use the TNT on, say... Guys, check it out. We use the pistons, the redstone, and the TNT to build a TNT launcher. Then, I climb on, and you guys blast me all the way into the Witherstorm. <laughs> Heck yeah! I love that idea. So what are we waiting for? Let's hurry up and... Oh, look out! Ah! Axel! Ocelots, distract that wither storm. Hey, you, get a load of this. Lucas, thank you. Anything for a friend. Now let's hurry up and build this thing. You guys done yet? I just need a few more seconds. Okay, it's finished. Quick, climb on. And Jesse, I know you can do this. We all do. Thanks, guys. It means a lot. Now go demolish that command block. <gasps> Ruben, this is no place for us.
great. Ruben, whatever happens, we have to destroy that command block. You understand? Whoa. Why didn't I always carry an enchanted weapon? I'm coming, Ruben! Doing everything I can to protect the command block. Which means I have to do everything I can to destroy it. Awesome weapon. Don't fail me now. to get up there. The tractor beam! Hey, you! Ruben, I'll be fine. I'm not gonna let it suck me all the way up. Just close enough to do what I have to do. Bet you can't catch me! get up there. The tractor beam! Hey, you! Ruben, I'll be fine. I'm not gonna let it suck me all the way up. Just close enough to do what I have to do. Bet you can't catch me!
are. Jesse, are you all right? We thought you were... I mean, I didn't think he'd made it. Reuben! Where's Reuben? I thought he was with you. You did it, Jesse! You actually did it! Hey, do you guys hear something? Reuben! No. Lupin? You're a hero. You know that? You just helped save the world. Come on, Rube. Say something. Ruben, don't do this to me. I need you, boy. Jesse, I am... I am so sorry. People used to look at me like that once, Jesse. Having my memory restored has been both a blessing and a curse. Perhaps they deserve to know the truth about the Order. All those lies we told them. Maybe I should finally come clean. Don't tell them, Gabriel. Just let them have their legend. We all owe a great debt to Jessie and her friends, but I owe a debt to you people as well. Which is why, there is something I want to tell you about the Order. We may have defeated the Ender Dragon, but that is nothing compared to what these heroes did. They took down a Witherstorm! They are a new generation of heroes! I know you think I'm up here because I saved the world or something, but the truth is, I didn't do it alone. Far from it. You see, I had my friends with me. 
There was Olivia, Axel, Petra, Lucas. They stood by my side, right from the start. Well, and they made fun of me when I deserved it. But that's just how we are. Dang right we are. It's crazy to think my friends and I started out in a treehouse. And now, we've been to some of the weirdest places in the world. I mean, come on. We went to the Far Lands. There was this gigantic wall, and a huge maze, and a model of the Ender Dragon that... Well, you just had to be there. But when all was said and done, you know what really mattered? My hero, Reuben the pig. He may have seemed like just a pig to most people, but he was so much more. And at the end of the day, he saved us all. For Reuben! Yes! Jesse, this nether star is all that remained when the wither storm was destroyed. Would you please do the honors? Oh man, this is gonna be so cool. to introduce to you the new Order of the Stone. And so it was that a new Order of the Stone was born. One whose adventures were only just beginning. For though the world had been saved, and the command block destroyed, there are many more worlds than just this one.